Good late afternoon. Good evening to you folks. Um, uh, in Art 1014, Module 3, the Narrative Film class. My, my name is Professor Eric Yates Green, and I am your instructor, your team leader, your professor for this uh, third module of this semester. Um, again, uh, and it's on narrative film. You've been doing the narrative throughout the semester, and this is the one on narrative film. Um, and so for the next, uh, this week plus three and a half more weeks, we'll be looking at the history of that and the process of that. Um, in a nutshell, we're going to be studying film that you'll be doing with the homework assignment this weekend uh, and understanding how three-act structure works. Uh, next week, we'll be actually coming up with story ideas, your own unique story ideas. Um, and then the following week, you will be putting those ideas into uh, a format we call script writing. Uh, and and uh, I'll be showing you how to use a software for script writing based on your own story ideas. And the last week, um, beginning of that week, uh, week number four, you will be making a film uh, with your own technology at home. And I'll be showing you the process of editing that film. And um, the week after, which is uh, actually the exam week, the finals week, um, we will be having a screening of all your films. So you're going to learn how to... to um, to make the film, to edit it, and then we're going to upload it and have a, uh, a class screening um, so we can all watch the films together, actually, th the last week of the semester. So um, I also want to apologize for my technical problems yesterday. Um, I've been trying to record and work um, from Washington, North Carolina. I live down the road in Washington a bit um, with my laptop, and it's proven to be not effective. It, uh, my internet signal is too weak. Um, and uh, I, I think maybe some of you might, folks might have challenges with the internet too, this, the way we're teaching the class. But um, I apologize. I, I'm sorry that happened yesterday. Um, and I've, I've now moved all my operations to here. I don't know if you guys know this room, but this is the, uh, this is the equipment room um, uh, in the film and video production department. Uh, it's very quiet. It's safe. Uh, I've got social distancing. Um, so I'm going to be uh, recording videos and sending assignments from now until the rest of the semester in this room. I won't be living here, but I, I will be. This will be my home base, and you'll see this background because I've got a, a good Mac computer here with high speed, and there's no problem recording or uploading. Um, I also want to introduce uh, a friend back here. His name is Bibas. He's um, Bibas is the mascot of the equipment room, so he's back there hanging out. Uh, and it's good to have some company here. Um, even Bebos and I are practicing social distancing, so it's going to be okay. Um, the way this class is structured, obviously we're in a unique time now in, in this state, in Greenville, in the country, in the world. Um, so, you know what? We're artists, and uh, this would normally be a one-on-one -on -one class presentation. Uh, but we can't do that right now. Uh, we'll be doing it as soon as this gets settled. And we'll, you guys will be obviously welcome back to the School of Art and Design sometime in the future. Um, but we're artists, so we're, we're going to find a way to make this work um, uh, through technology that we have and through your home computers, through, through my office computer here that I'll be using now for the rest of the semester. And we'll make it work. Um, learning film has gotten a lot easier and the equipment's gotten smaller and in fact now you folks have your own equipment called a cell phone so you're going to find out that actually that's quite a, a, a terrific piece of equipment and with software we can get from the internet um, and the process of meeting together as a group we'll do some meetings this semester uh, this this module through zoom and we'll all be together there'll also be some other days when i will just send you homeworks and you will do them and upload them to dropbox so, um, you know, we'll make it work. And it, and it is what it is. And again, we're artists and we find a way. It's interesting in the arts many times when you have challenges, um, uh, it often brings about even better results or, or we have to adapt. So um, I look forward to this, this module with you folks very much. And, um, and we're starting with today. Again, sorry for the technical problems, but now that this is my home base, there'll be no more problems. Um, in terms of the syllabus, I sent it to you guys a little earlier this week, uh, and you looked over it. Um, if you have any problems, let me know or questions about the syllabus. Uh, um, one thing I will say is 
Um, as of today and this first week, obviously, and even into next week, um, we don't necessarily have to meet at the same time. I think that's going to be challenging. You folks have your own schedule. Um, I'm very open on schedule, but to get all of us to sit together at the same time, at the, you know, on a computer, we will try that at least once or twice this semester. But normally, um, I will be sending assignments to you. I'll be giving you a video, and you will upload your assignment work to Dropbox, so we I can get it very easily, and then we can discuss it um, through through communications often with words as opposed to you know being at the computer at the same time. But we are going to try a couple times to, to be together um, through Zoom, and um, I will be talking to you more about how to, how to get that set up on your own computers. Um, I did get the um, assignment one, number one uh, on Dropbox from most of you, so I know you're, most of you are getting my emails. Um, and I, I thought you guys did a great job. It, as you, it was a biographical series of questions about who you are and where you're from, um, what your ambitions were or are in the School of Art and Design, and maybe how, how you see yourself in the future. Even I was asking you to think, think 10 years ahead of time. Um, I really enjoyed reading your answers. Um, uh, it, it gave me, it reminded me when I was an undergrad, um, I studied at the School of Design in Raleigh, and then I studied film in California. But I, I think many of you have very strong um, clarity on, on what you're doing, and some of you are still trying to decide what kind of concentration to take, of course, you're, you're a freshman and first semester transfer students. But I really enjoyed um, uh, getting to know you through your answers, and uh, I'll be responding to you guys on, uh, about that through emails to you directly. Um, the other thing you were to do for assignment number one was to look at the, um, there were two documents and a short slideshow I sent you about the, what we call narrative structure. So narrative structure is it's um, how we frame and how we um, uh, line up uh, what's called you know a story, you know made it made into a film, since we're studying narrative film. So um, there is a process of that. There's a first act, a second act, a third act. There's a thing called the inciting incident. And then the second act builds to a climax, and then in the third act it resolves. Um, I do know from the different things I gave you to watch, there's some different language being used. So assignment number two will help clarify the language that I want to express in these terms, and what, what we can use you and I together for, for this semester. Um, so, uh, so the reading number one was just a background. And again, I, I got um, the biographical answers for assignment number one from most of you. There are some of you I didn't get the homework, so I don't know if that was a, a matter of not having the same uh, ability to get on the internet, but I will be writing you um, directly tonight um, on Friday the ones I didn't get just to make sure that we're on the same page about how to communicate and how to upload homeworks. Um, as far as assignment go number two goes, um, now that I've got a base here working, I'm going to post that this evening. Um, I wanted to get this video out first, but um, uh, for assignment number two, essentially I'm going to ask you to watch a very short film called Embrace Life. It's a one-minute film, and I will give you an example, a document example, of how I break down um, the film Embrace Life in three-act structure language uh, that will be posted this evening. Um, that what you will do for the for your own in terms of uh, creative um, you know, learning and experience is after you watch the film Embrace Life and see how I broke it down in terms of three-act structure, I'm going to ask you to watch two more very short films. These are all about a minute each. Um, one's called Belgrade and one is called Game. And you will, um, you know, after watching these films, use your own imagination to to think about and how to how these films were structured. Um, as well, and that will be a sense be your homework for the weekend to, to watch two short films and break them down in terms of three act structure. Um, right now it's 5.07 on Friday evening, and I again I have the technology now working, um, including this video um, you're getting it through, through YouTube. Um, so I'm now going to post the rest of the homework now that I know I've got a handle on the technology here at school and um, my poor laptop. Um, I think I have to get a new one, but but uh, those will be posted this evening on Friday, and you will have Saturday and Sunday and Monday um, to watch those two short films and to to break them down 
uh, in terms of three-act structure using the language I'll present um, this evening with uh, the film called um, Embrace Life. So that's it. I wanted to just use this film, this, the, this opportunity to say hello to you. Um, again, apologize about technology challenges. I had them first. You folks, <laughs> I hope you don't have any, but I had them first, so my, my bad. But I, I will now make that work. Um, and to thank you for assignment number ones. Um, I, I do, again, once you look at the syllabus and send me any questions you might have about the syllabus. Uh, and then watch out for uh, assignment number two. I'm posting it this evening. Um, onto um, Blackboard, and uh, I give myself the, the deadline of midnight, so I've got seven hours to pull it off, so I, I know I can do it. Um, and then you'll have Saturday and Sunday and Monday to do it. Um, you'll see when you get assignment number two that your homework will go up onto dropbox.com, just the way it did for assignment number one, and you have until Tuesday to get that finished. That's it. Okay, and I wanted to say um, welcome to the class. I, I love this class. I love teaching. I love filmmaking. And I'm very excited to be um, doing this with your, your, your class. Um, so be in touch with me. I'll be in touch with you. And uh, welcome to, um, to Art 1015, Module Number 3, Narrative Film. Until next time, see you later. Bye-bye from Eric.